I think that Beagle is one of the most exciting uh, projects on honeybees of the past decades supported by the European Commission because it's tackling really a crucial uh, issue. Uh, there are 17 partners involved coming from 13 European member states. So uh, it tackles uh, two uh, very important questions. One is on the health and sustainability and uh, these, these are very difficult ones. I, I mean only the definition of, of health so you can consider it as non, not dead and that's very often been, being considered as, as an, an definition let's say for, for honeybees. We believe that uh, the, the definition of uh, health in the context of honeybees is much more complex and that you should in fact categorize the health and this is what we will do with the health status index that we will try to develop. So, but when you man try to maintain the health of a bee colony, then you have the prob problem that, in fact, health and performance of a bee colony depends on a triangular relationship where man, bees and environment play a role. And this is very complex because bees are semi-domesticated, so it is much more uh, complex than in the ordinary uh, domesticated animals, let's say. About sustainability, it means that we that we do not cause any problems for coming generations, that the decision that we now make will not be uh, negative for, uh, for our grandchildren, let's say. So we do have a plan and the plan is in fact that we will collect big data. Big data coming from the hive, uh, preferentially collected in an automated way so we have sensors putting in different hives and collect data automatically but we will also do perform some laboratory analysis on diseases on uh, genetics we will measure uh, uh, data in of the environment of the climate of the vegetation but also of the economics and uh, we have uh, a few uh, very interesting, very exciting novel uh, tools that we will develop. For instance, an accelerometer that will measure vibrations into the, the colony. And we will con combine all this data in a flow and eventually try to understand the, the relationship between all these factors and the health status index. Finally, we uh, will also develop models models of uh, the landscape and the landscape wherein we put a model of the honeybee colony and this all together will allow us to make predictions about health of the colony. So there are two real world examples of our uh, project, uh, of the outcome of our project. And the first is in fact that we will allow risk assessment, risk assessment of multiple stressors. And the second one is that we, it will allow us to give guidance in the decision making of the beekeepers.